Okay, so... Ooh. Hell no. Hell no. You know, you can't... Your son is born... And there's... You can't predict what he's going to do or what he's going to like in his life. So, I see parents nowadays pushing, pushing, pushing. My son has to compete. My son has to do that. And you see the, the poor kid looking at his dad. Some kids actually like it, but others don't. And they compete because of the pressure of their, the mom or dad. And you know what's that gonna lead them? Nowhere. Have you ever seen a kid that won and competed and then went on to adults to win everything? No. People go through phases in life. You know? One thing is sure. I knew that he was going to train. If he liked it or not, if he was going to compete or not, that's a, another, another level, another, another situation. And why do you want him to train? To give him confidence, to give him uh, the knowledge of something that was great in your life and you, you want to share that with your son. Even though you might have been working with something else at the time, you still Oh, train, it's good for you, it's going to be good for you. Yeah, and he, in, 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 in Roger's case, uh, he had cousins, uncles, aunts, the whole family saying, did you train? Are you training? No. Yeah. So you feel a little bit uh, of pressure putting you in, in uh, yeah, I got to do this. But if he was going to be a great competitor, you can't predict that. Nobody can. It's impossible. He did that on his own because he wanted to. And he told his mom one day after Roger only tapped once in a competition as a blue belt. His first blue belt competition, he was 16 years old. And the guy got him in the figure four footlock. That's all that guy ever did. And he was really good at it. And he caught Roger. It was by uh, quick back and Roger was uh, really upset by it really upset I can see it in his face <coughs> and then he told his mom you'll see I'll be the greatest competitor ever and guess what he became that he never lost again he might have lost he never tapped again. He might, obviously, he lost. Nobody has a, puts his name out there like he did. Or even uh, uh, an example like Hansel. How many fights did Hansel have? How many fights did Roger have? Zinn. Can you win them all? No. Sometimes you, you win, sometimes you lose. Obviously, the majority of fights were, were won. And like Roger, his submission rate was unbelievable. Even nowadays, the IBJJF did, a little while back, a survey saying uh, the com competitors, uh, by the percentage of submissions, Roger was in the, in, the, in the first place and the second place was, didn't have 50% of his wins. And how unbelievable is that? He submitted nearly everybody he, he fought. So, can you... Can you predict that? No, how can you predict that? Obviously when he uh, started winning, you know, even uh, there was a video the other day of uh, him fighting uh, uh, Jacare in the final fight of the absolute ground. Oh my God, that was an unbelievable fight. 
It was the best fight of that competition. Even in the, they had really good black belt fights, but it was the best fight of the competition was Hwajan Jakara, absolute brown belt. And there, or even before, as a blue belt, I remember one competition that he won, one of the, his uh, first world competition as a blue belt. And I think he had like 15 fights in a day, something like that. And when, when everybody, then he said, oh, there's something there. And then purple belt. And then brown. All by submission. And then black belt. I'm not even going to get into referee mistakes. Because then you... A lot of people say, oh, I don't want to get into that. But his achievements are, make us so proud. Yeah. It was so beautiful to see him fight. I miss that, you know? I know he's not going to fight again, but I really do miss that, going to those competitions and watching him march and fight. Oh man, the the adrenaline, the the going, the getting there, and oh man, oh. <laughs> you want to do this, this videos, tradition, and everything. Yeah, you want to do, want him to do well. And he, in in most cases, a lot of times he lost to himself. The guy wasn't better than him. I didn't see anybody being better than him in doing. Oh, he lost because that guy did that specific. No. No. He had to make a bad judgment or waited too long. Or... It's unbelievable. It's just, it's just unbelievable. It's uh, an art to see him fight. Yeah. Still today. Well, that doesn't, didn't stop just because he's not competing. 